I'm sure many of you saw some comments made by a particular musician, uh, Kanye West, uh, in recent days, and he was saying disparaging things about one of your most successful portfolio companies um, and Kim Kardashian, the founder of the company. I just have to ask, what, what do you, what's your relationship like with Kanye West? <laughs> <laughs> Um, I already see the phones going up. Um, yeah, getting called out by Kanye on Instagram was not on last week's bingo card for me. Um, but, you know, as a firm, we're incredibly heads down. Uh -huh. um, we do our best to kind of keep to ourselves and uh, are entirely focused on doing whatever we can to be the most meaningful partner to our founders and supporting those founders. And we feel really fortunate to work with that business in particular and to support Kim and Jens and Emma and all the people involved and um, feel very grateful for that. On, on a personal level and a human level, um, you know, I think some of the comments that were made specifically around anti-Semitism are, are, are disappointing to me. And I'll leave it at that. I think this is an investing conference, um, but I'll leave it at that. Have you spoken to him since then? Is this TMZ? <laughs> or is, is this Daily Mail? TMZ come on, Sarah. Us. Oh, come on. Come on. Inquiring minds want to know. I know. <laughs> we are heads down and focused as a firm, and I think we've done a really good job of avoiding distractions. And um, I think um, that is our ethos as an organization. And, you know, we just keep our heads down and stay focused.